physics has its fair share of beautiful questions. But sometimes beauty lies in the simplest of things. Like say, why is the sky blue? Or why is the sun yellow or orange or red during sunsets? Well, luckily we have managed to get some answers for these. Now, take a look at this solution. It is a true solution. And let me tell you, in a true solution, the particles are very very small. Now, if I pass a laser light through one end of the solution, you cannot see the path of the light. But if I put some Dettol in it, now it becomes a colloidal solution. This time, if I pass light through this colloidal solution, the light path can be observed. This is because in a colloidal solution, the light gets scattered and this effect is called Tyndall effect. Now imagine the earth as a big ball of colloidal solution. It in fact is, with so many particles in it. Particles like smoke, dust, water particles and molecules of air. So what happens when light passes through earth's atmosphere? And from what we know, light is made up of these seven colors, which we can see the colors of the rainbow, with GR. And violet has the least wavelength and red has the longest wavelength. And what happens is the colors with the least wavelength get scattered more than the ones with longer wavelength. And this is precisely the reason why you see the sky as blue. Now, the next time you are in a theater watching a movie, observe the Tyndall effect there where light is being projected on a screen due to scattering of light by small particles. So what have we learned in this video? We have seen why the sky is blue and also a little bit about the Tyndall effect and its causes and its uses. So until next time, happy learning!